Hey folks, James McCormick here, Captain, United States Army, retired, and I'm coming to you today to talk to you about an organization called Vets for Vet Leadership. And that organization is designed on the principles that we need more veterans in Congress and we need people with honor, integrity, and discipline that are going to be serving us, you, me, the American people. It's no secret as you look around the problems that we're experiencing now. In 2018, we experienced the first time in 75 years where we had obtained energy independence and we've already lost that footing. In addition, we see prices, economic prices that have went up higher than they've been in over 40 years. And we're experiencing that right now. We're watching the war that is going on on Ukraine right now. And we're also just coming out of the retreat from Afghanistan that injured so many people, injured them emotionally because of all of the sacrifices that many of us made, myself and my sons being part of that sacrifice. And folks, let me tell you something. We have got to come together as a country and we've got to support putting good, solid veteran candidates in office that are going to stand up and are going to understand what leadership truly means. Let's break down the leadership acronym. Leadership starts with loyalty. Loyalty to your country, loyalty to the United States Constitution, and loyalty to the people that we serve. It doesn't mean that you sway off on a, a tangent or you go to support just certain initiatives or agendas. It means that you fully support and embrace the United States Constitution and ensure that we defend it against all enemies, foreign and domestic. We're going to talk about discipline. We need leaders with discipline. Leaders that can say no and can say yes when they need to say yes. Leaders that aren't afraid to have, have a little bit of humility because they have disciplined themselves to be able to accept answers and to be able to work together to get the job done. We need respect. We need respect for not just each other, but also the rule of law. Nowhere. Nowhere are we going to get anywhere burning down buildings or destroying cities. We've got to get beyond that, folks. We must. Then we need selfless service. People that are going to go do those things because it's the right thing to do. Not because it benefits them or it's going to make them any more money, but because they're selfless in their cause. They want to do something that is right and righteous for the United States of America. And your veterans that are going to be listed with Vets for Vet leadership are going to be well vetted and they are going to stand on those principles. Then we're going to talk about honor. True honor, a word that's often kicked around like a can on the playground, but is rarely adhered to. Honor means that you do the right thing. Honor means that you protect your reputation and the reputation of your country. Honor means that you will sacrifice everything that you've got to ensure that that honor is not tainted. Then let's go to integrity. Integrity, folks, is so important. If you don't have integrity, you don't have anything. Integrity means that you won't lie, you won't steal, you won't cheat, nor you won't tolerate those that do. We have to stand up for integrity. We have to be the people that the kids look to and they want to be like you. That's what we need. And you know what else you got to have above all things? You've got to have the personal courage to do it. So you take the personal courage right now and support our fight at vetsforvetleadership.org. We'll be looking for you on the field, folks. Let us go forward and let us truly make integrity great again in America because it's high time that we do it. God bless you and God bless America, folks.